Hello, dragons. I'm Gemma from Scoff Paper, and we make the cards your dog can eat. Today, I'm here looking for a £50,000 investment for a 10% equity of my business. Together with my small team, we make edible cards from potatoes. 10 years ago, I was working in a highly stressful job. I had a heart attack. And now I've got a pacemaker that I call Jerry. In order to recover, I started to volunteer for guide dogs. So I am what they call a puppy raiser. I am that crazy dog lover. I throw lots of parties. <laughs> it was at one such party that one of the doggy guests tried to eat one of the paper birthday cards. Hey presto, the idea was born. I started the business in December 2020 from my kitchen table. And now we have our own manufacture facility in Lancashire that we call the Scoffice. I've predominantly sold the cards direct to the pet trade. So the cards are in lots of lovely independent pet specialists and also the likes of Pets at Home amongst others. So Leo's going to leave me now to let me do the hard work. Um, and then I can share with you the samples that you've got in your special boxes. Goodbye, Leo. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> Come on, then. Gemma, sales to date, you started December 2020. Yes, So let's that's just right. look at 2021 and 2022. Could you give me yeah. the revenue, the gross profit and the net profit on those years? Yeah, sure. So um, year two, we did um, 121,000 and we had a net profit of 25,000. Year three to date, we've done 55 and a net loss of 22. But we do have a healthy pipeline um, to end the year, which... What are you forecasting? Yep, so I'm forecasting 136,000 and a net of circa 18. 18. What are the big accounts that you've got? I think you've mentioned some yeah. quite big household names. Yeah, so we're working with uh, Pets at Home. We've done um, circa 15,000 cards with Across them. how many stores? 200 stores. And we did a trial in 50 Pets Corner stores just before Christmas. Um, they're rolling that out to 150 of their stores imminently. We've also got a purchase order to go into 1,022 Aldi stores for one of their upcoming pet events. So you have driven the relationships and the contracts that you've got with all of those big retailers that you talked about? Yeah, I've done it all direct. That is, yeah. for a business at this stage in its life, that is outstanding. I mean, your sales track record already shows that there is demand there. You do need to pour fuel onto that fire to really make it a big business. But with your passion, with your energy, I actually think you'll get there. However, I just don't know if I'm as barking mad as you are about selling edible doggy birthday cards. So I'm going to say that I'm out. Oh, thank you. So I think you have got a good business here, without a doubt. But I think it's novelty. Mm-hmm. And I'm not sure I can envisage a future where that buys its space permanently in store. So I'm afraid, Gemma, I won't be investing. I'm out. My instinct tells me to keep this business exactly where it's at and build this out with those partnerships to see how far this can go. It's going to produce a nice income for you, but the room for an investor is tiny. So I'm going to say that I'm out, but I don't want to take anything away from that enthusiasm. And I think because of you, you'll make it a success. So good luck. Thank you so much. Thank you. It looks like you've got a very strong retail business. Yeah. And you, you want to go direct to consumer. I'm willing to give you half the money. That's £25,000, but I want 15%. And I'm assuming another dragon will want 15%. Thank you so much. That's really kind. Thank you. <laughs> Gemma, I think you've done a fantastic job. I think you've got a great business. So I'm also going to make you an offer. I would give you all of the money, all 50000 for 25% of the business, 
with a reduction to 20% after, okay. if I get my money returned within the 12 months, that will go down to 20%. Be partners at that. Wow. I'm very willing to share it with Sarah if she feels that she needs some help in the um, retail world. Would you be open to sharing the investment with Tuka? And I've got a lot of investments with Tuga, and we work brilliantly well together. He's got a lot of ins with a lot of retailers. However, that's the bit that you're absolutely nailing. Yeah. So on that basis, I think I would say my offer stands as it is for all the money. Thank you so much. This is really surreal. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll put my money elsewhere. You've just got to say I accept your offer. If you accept it. You put the words in my mouth. Of course I do. Woo! Fabulous. That is brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, congratulations, oh, Thank you, so much. Thank Thank you so much. Well done. Bye. Bye.